welcome again to design with lacing this is another tutorial on how you can edit your 3d logo mockup using your mobile phone so in this video i'm going to walk you down how you can resize your um, logo on your mockup how you can change colors on your mockup using your mobile phone using photopia so for this video we are going to use um, the template the 3d logo mockup template in photopia to practice okay so this applies to any mock any 3d logo mockup that you download online so now I'll tap on the template here you can find several templates that you can use so when you tap on that template you are going to see different templates here here you are going to um, tap on you can see we have mockups here so just tap on mockups when you tap on the mockups then you scroll the your screen this way so that you can see all the more necessary mockups here so if you should scroll down you can see we have so many of them okay you have so many of them so anyone you like you can pick and make use of so for this i'm going to just pick one then i use that to demonstrate to you how you can simply um scale your logo mockup up so let's make use of this and see um how you can do this so anyone you select so um, anyone you like you tap inside this image just tap inside the image then you will see another uh, place like this now tap inside this image again so when i tap inside that image it will load so you can see the loading on my screen is loading and when it's done loading we are going to um see how to change colors and all that if you haven't subscribed to this channel please do where to subscribe to this channel and turn off the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos okay so this is our mock-up it has loaded up like this so here is the mock-up so now first let's see how we can change um this mock this logo on this mock-up so to do that you um tap on your layer panel this is layer icon panel just tap on that when you tap on that you can see save, um, several layers like this don't be afraid i'm going to explain to you how this thing works so here we have different layers this layer that you see you can see what is written on this layer is your logo here so they are telling you to upload your logo on these other layers okay all right then the next one here we have the light then we have the effect and we have the shadows we have the background so let's see how we can turn off some of these things on our mock-up okay all right so now we are going to to input our logo to upload our logo to this mockup and change the initial logo of this mockup this is what you are going to do you can see here we have the um, place your logo here so this is what you are going to do pay attention to this because so many persons have been asking me question on this okay all right so inside this box that you see double tap inside this box if i double tap inside it will open up like this so let me remove my layer panel so that you see so you can see it takes me to this place this is the initial place then when you double tap inside this box it takes you to this other place all right so we have this so now I tap on the layer panel again to see just tap on that so we can see we have a, a logo here a logo is already here so we are going to upload our own logo to this place then turn off the visibility of this original logo that was here to do that go to your file go to file just tap on that among this option you are going to see open and place look at it tap on that to place your logo that you have downloaded but before you place your logo make sure that, that your logo is a png logo without background without background okay no most of you will come to my dm and be asking me this question make sure your logo is without a background so i'm going to tap on my logo and upload it so if you are um if you want to know how to design logo you can use canva you can use pizza lab you can use photoshop to design logo okay so this is the logo you can see my logo here is without a background there's no background it's just the logo okay so now go to your layer panel to turn to remove this original logo that was here so just tap on your layer panel then here you can see the um, original logo so you just tap on this eye icon to turn it off just tap on the eye icon to turn it off so you can see the, it's not there again so we have our own initial logo okay now to scale up your logo this your logo to scale up this logo show this click on this place transform control just tap on that and you're going to see this box around your logo hold any of these points to scale it up 
like this take it to the center after scaling it up scale it up again and take it to the center just like this so when you are done you tap on your um your uh, selection to just tap on that then remove the transform control around your logo so we have this now pay attention to this also now go to your file when you tap on the file here you will see save smart object some people some of you are complaining of not having this option on your own but if you follow this process just follow this tutorial you will have this save smart object look at this save smart object that is what we are going to use so when i tap on that you are going to just tap on it once and you can see smart object has been updated so now you can you can tap on this cancel button to remove this window so you just tap on that and that window will be closed so you can see we have our logo here look at the logo we have our logo here now if you can see you will see that this logo is small on this mock-up so how do you in, increase um scale up the logo size after doing your mock-up like this this is what you are going to do okay go to your layer panel select the layer panel open it up and you are going to see other um other layers like this so these layers controls the um, logo this this four layers controls the logo so um this applies to any mock-up you want to scale up the size of your logo on okay so uh we are going to see layers like this but bear in mind you, you might um see maybe two layers two groups or three groups as the case may be but this is the same process that you are going to use so for us to scale this up we have to um select each of these select them at the same time and to do that this is what you are going to do okay we have the uh, a keyboard button here at this place a keyboard button tap on that keyboard button enable the control icon okay the control here then uh, with this selector you can select any of these layers at the same time so see what i'm going to do if i tap on this two layer two of them will be selected i tap on these three selected tap on this four selected so that is how you can do this okay so with this four selected i'm going to close the layer panel then i will show this transform control i'll turn it on then let me use my finger and scale this down so that we can see. so now here is it so we can see this all of them like this so you will use this point look at this point you use this point to scale it up just the way you want and place it perfectly just like this so if i use my finger and scale it up so as you are scaling you just be patient because since the file is large it's going to um, slack a little bit so just scale it up the way you want like this okay then place it perfectly at the center of the page let me scale this other side up again okay so you are going to see this so if you are not okay with the size you can keep on scaling it up until you are okay with the size when you are done you tap on this this button the selection to just select that then turn um then turn off the transform control so you have this so if i should scale it up you can see that our logo is much bigger now so when you are done you go to file and save your design then you can enjoy your design so you export it as jpeg or png as the case may be so this is how you scale up your logo and scale down your logo on any logo mock-up using photopia thank you guys don't forget to like this video i will see you in my next video